Pneumococcal disease is a huge global health problem, killing as many people as malaria. Every minute, somewhere in the world, a child dies of pneumococcal disease. There are no preventive measures that have been carried out against the pneumococcus in our setting. I think I'll describe the feeling that I have as being helpless because you see these children when they have already developed the disease and it's not good. It's not good. Pneumonia is an under-recognized problem. It's this huge cause of death, and yet there are very few people working on pneumonia. What we need for developing countries is a vaccine that also includes some of the important strains that are not found in the developed world. So this is the vaccine with the extra two types in it, which hopefully makes it better for children in the developing world. If this vaccine works, we'll have for the first time a vaccine tailored for developing countries which could prevent pneumonia in millions of children. The results of the clinical trial are incredibly encouraging, but for us the work has only just begun. My biggest fear is that in spite of vaccine trials like the one here in Soweto that prove that the vaccine can protect children, 10 to 15 years will pass before we get these vaccines used where they're needed the most, that is in the developing world. Okay, I'd be very glad if we did have a vaccine against pneumococcal disease because we'd be able to reduce the incidence of this common disease, less children would suffer. My hope is that if we're successful, we can accelerate the use of this vaccine in the world's poorest countries by as much as 10 years over what's historically been seen, and we might start saving lives as early as 2008.